This is Foebe Wahengo, a Namibian national. She is currently pursuing her PhD in metallurgy and mineral processing at the Copper Belt University in Zambia. The Copper Belt is metallurgy. Uh, basically, you want to learn or to get the knowledge from where the main field is. And this being a Copper Belt, I felt like uh, I can learn a lot from these people because they are in the midst of the whole minerals. Thing. This is being made possible courtesy of the Africa Center of Excellence for Sustainable Mining, a World Bank funded project. My bachelor's degree was in, uh, or is in uh, chemics, chemistry and biology from the University of Namibia. And then uh, my master's is from the University of Stellenbosch, or Stellenbosch University rather. Uh, which I did uh, mineral processing or extractive metallurgy. Yeah, so I bridged from science, pure science, into metallurgy. Foebi is working on a project focusing on how best nickel can be separated from cobalt minerals. The project is mainly looking at separating nickel, uh, which is a mineral found together with cobalt. So what we're trying to do is to remove this nickel from cobalt because when, it, uh, when you're doing a cobalt extraction and you're looking for cobalt metal, if, it, if nickel is found in the product of cobalt, it usually ends up as a, a penalty to the customers, um, I mean from the customers to, 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 the, to the company. So what you want is to have very little of nickel in that product. So what I'm trying to do now is to look for a better way of uh, removing nickel from cobalt material so that we have a, a more purer cobalt mineral at the end. What is there for her after this Copper Belt University journey? After I finish, I have to go back to my country and save my beautiful department as a metallurgist um, being a lecturer in metallurgy and that is what I'm doing here so in actual fact it's just an addition of knowledge so that I can give better uh, to the students so far um, but mainly I'm interested in research of course and uh, lecturing but research is my main area of interest in the same uh, the same field indeed this support from the World Bank will have a huge impact on generations to come.